Alrighty, we're kind of doing an overview of the Kydex Borai Eagle pocket holster. I've got my LCR here, my LCR 22. This style of holster from Borai is one that I've used for a handful of the pocket guns that I've tested. I really like it, but I kind of want to go over just some exercises of drawing, firing one, and then showing how to clip the holster back onto the gun safely, and then how to put the holster and gun package back into the pocket there. So I'm going to begin with my hand formed on the grip in the pocket, and I've got my shot timer here so we can kind of get the metrics for the first round fired here. Starting on beep. Fired one round there, and that was in 1.56, a little bit more deliberate. Let's see, I've still got a couple rounds here in the gun. So to, to safely reholster this, we want to shift the gun to our support hand as such, take our holster and clip it on. From there, I'm going to take my pocket material with my firing hand and put it back into the pants, because sometimes, especially with these Kydex holsters, your pocket material will actually try to come back out of the pants. Shift the gun back to my primary hand, and I'm going to clear my cover garment and put the gun into the pocket. So, yeah, not too much to think about there, but you can't really reholster this gun with the holster still in the pocket. You want to pull it out of the pocket, clip it to the gun, and then put it away. So, another one here. Cool. Shot that in 126. Again, transferring the gun to the support hand, keeping it safely pointed down range here taking the holster and clipping it onto the gun. I'm pushing my pocket material back into my pants, transferring back over to the right hand here, and then safely reholstering the gun into my pocket. With some of the heavier suede or felt pocket holsters, usually the holster will retain in the pocket and will be kind of open mouth, so it's easier to put the gun back in there with the holster still in the pocket. But for a Kydex one, we wanna make sure that we're actually pulling the holster out of the pocket. Do another one here. Again, fairly deliberate there. Shot that in 122. Going to shift the gun back over to the left hand. Pocket holster's coming out, clipped onto the gun, pushing the material back into my pants, shifting back to the right hand here, and then reholstering into the pocket. And I believe I have one more round in here, otherwise we might get a click when I fire the gun. Okay, starting on beep here. I believe that was all of my rounds, and yes it was. So we're gonna reload here the LCR-22. And again, same deal as before. Holster goes back onto the gun, push the, the material back into the pocket, and then reholster the gun. So yeah, the Borai Eagle's a holster that I've really enjoyed. I found it to work better for certain guns, such as like revolvers. For a lot of the small auto loaders like the LCP, since the package is already so small, you have to be extra deliberate to make sure you actually yank the holster uh, off the gun when you're doing your draw stroke. But for the revolvers, I've not really had any sort of instances where I pull out and the holster still attached to the gun. So thank you for watching, and when it's live, I'll link my full uh, Borai Eagle review down below. Take care.